Yeah. How did the memory exercise go? Well, to hear it from Adler, it's working. Bell remembered finding that encrypted intel in Vietnam and has almost finished decoding it. Anything useful in there? Some names, apparently. Possible leads. Park is trying to connect the dots. We don't have much time. Does the team know about our mishap in Berlin yet? No, but if it's connected to one of those names from Bell, they'll find out soon enough. You won't let that happen, Hudson. Don't say anything more than necessary. That's never been a problem for me. We finished analyzing the names Bell acquired at Nang. One in particular stands out. Anton Volkov. He's a Russian arms dealer working out of East Berlin. Admittedly, his connection to Perseus comes as a surprise. We've got killer capture orders on Volkov. So if we can't get to Perseus, we'll get to his men. Close off his resources, force him out of hiding. Mason and Woods are still wrapping up business in Kiev. Which means Volkov is ours. Gear up, and we'll move out. MI6 has been tracking Volkov for seven years. It is my strong preference that we attempt to capture rather than kill him. He holds answers to... So listen up. An ex-CIA operative named Robert Aldrich has gone rogue. Langley... MI6 has spent the last year tracking a group of embedded Soviet agents within multiple European governments. These agents could be strategically positioned to set up a larger Soviet plan for Europe. During a recent operation, we acquired information about this group's structure. There are three unidentified key agents leading it, and their handler is the Soviet major Vadim Rudnik, a name previously connected to Perseus. We have Rudnik's position and can move on him. But if we don't first identify his three lead agents, we risk losing our chance to take all of the embedded agents down. Check out our list of suspects here. Special evidence you find on missions will help identify the three lead agents. I'd advise figuring out who they are before going after Rudnik.
Okay. Woods and Mason are gonna take point on this. Apparently, Rudnik is lying low in a remote Soviet base in the mountains of Uzbekistan. Not remote enough. We're gonna land our boys nearby and pay him a little visit. Let's cut this Perseus sucker down to size. Command sounded confident. Once we blow the shit out of their radio tower and create a distraction, we'll find out. It's time for a little hide and seek. All right, we're in position. Roger that. There's an airmail package ready for delivery. Just need an address. Go ahead and mark the radio tower for us. Basically, the tower's up above on that far ridge. Coordinates coming your way. Roger. The check is in the mail. Rudnik isn't here. Go on and move to the next building. Another down.
I got Rudnik. We need kill confirmation. Kill confirmed. We got the pick to prove it. Maybe next time we can draw pictures for them too. Nice work. Evac chopper inbound. Pop some smoke to mark your location. Smoke out! Chopper's just a few minutes out. Look 
sharp. More on the way. Mason, we have air support on standby. Call it in if you need it. Send it in. Roger that. Send Time to raise the pay. Nice work producing that name, Bell.